Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today's video is a little bit exciting. I'm talking about the three hosting hacks that I think everyone should know when they're having guys over for maybe a games night or just having a dinner at their house. So my sister and I try to host a games night at least once a month where we can. And these are some tips and tricks that I found have really helped us get things going along the way. So my first tip that I have for you guys is that if you take fruits, grapes, maybe cut up pineapple and put them in the freezer, you can use them as ice cubes in your drinks and it, it's a way of cooling down your drink but also not diluting it as water an ice cube would normally do. And my second tip involves these beautiful bouquet of flowers. So of course you always have to have a centerpiece, something beautiful for everyone to look at. Um, a bouquet of this would normally be maybe 300, 400 shillings depending on your florist but the biggest tip that I have is you can also ask your florist to give you some petals and instead of plucking the, rose, the petals off the roses yourself, they can give you some petals from older flowers and those will be like around 100 to maybe 50 bob depending how much you want that you can use to scatter across the table and you know have a bit more design towards the table. And my final hosting hack is related to one of my Veda videos, which was on manners when visiting someone's house. I'll link that somewhere up here in the atmosphere. If someone brings you a bottle of wine or, you know, some drink when they're visiting your house and it's a bit warm or it's just not chilled, like white wine, my biggest tip is to take the bottle and take a cloth and run it under the sink and have it just a bit um, damp, a bit wet, wrap it around the bottle and put it in the freezer and it cools and chills down in, I kid you not, like 10 minutes as opposed to just putting the bottle in the freezer and waiting for close to an hour. It works with a bottle of wine, a packet of juice, just any kind of beverage that you want to chill in a quick amount of time. As I mentioned at the beginning of this video, we try host a games night every month and I wanted to show you guys this really cool game. The game is called 50-50 and it's 50 years of Kenya's history in 50 seconds. It's basically a trivia game with a Kenyan twist, similar to Taboo, kind of like charades, there's a board game involved and there's various ways that you can play it. So the cards have common Kenyan people, places and things on them like nice biscuits, big pin, arrowroot, toy market, um, Lyco Regency. So what you have to do is describe each and every one of them to the person in your team or the person across from you without using the word that's on the card. So for chapati, you can't actually roll, you can't signal out and roll out a chapati. You have to use your words and not the word chapati to describe it. And the person who can guess the most amount of words, the team that can guess the most amount of words, wins. And that's when you're playing it um, as a four, in a four way. The game can also be played um, with more members. So you can have up to one, two, three, four, up to five teams with as many players in each team. You have 50 seconds to guess what's on the card, on both sides of the card and one correct answer equals five points. The first team to get to 500 is the first team that wins the game. The game also comes with this board where you travel around um, the 50-50 board game and you know, if you land on a Supreme Court, which is just scattered all over the board game, you have to pick a card. And that's pretty much similar to in Monopoly, when you land on Chance or Community Chest, you get to pick a card and that either gives you more points or minuses points from your total score. We tried out this game for the first time um, at this month's games night and it was dramatic to say the least. Uh, Nazizi is a niche group. Uh, that's so nice. That's so nice. I probably a lawyer like from back in the day. Very like wears suits. Like <laughs> Dodger. 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 Yeah. Yes. The paper, but there's no paper this time. <laughs> the 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 whole thing. The This is like famous dance hall Kenyan Kenyan Yes, that's what it is. It's a really fun game. It's really nostalgic to run through and see the various things that are inherently Kenyan and also remind us of things that we grew up with or people that we know. If you want to order one of these games, I'll leave all the details for that in the description box below. And if you mention to them that you are ordering this game because you watched it off this um, video and you mentioned that you have a discount code which is noni5050 they will give you a discount on the overall price of the game anyway guys that's pretty much it for today's video if you give any of those hosting hacks a try let me know how they go for you and if you get the game i really hope you enjoy it thank you for watching today's video and i'll see you in the next one bye